Hello gamers, this is Flame Game 7 and welcome back to another video. Today is uh, Christmas Eve. I'm recording this Christmas Eve, last time I checked. <laughs> yeah, this is pretty last minute, but I kind of wanted to make an update video because it's like the end of the year. And you you know what this video is going to be about, but first I do want to say one thing. You may have noticed, started intro with Hey Gamers, that's going to be something I do from now on. Unless I decide I don't like it, but I think I like it. So we're going to be doing that from now on. But there's one thing everyone's been talking about. Channel updates, everything. Kappa. Just freaking Kappa. It's just... I. There's so many better videos to talk. Go watch Game Theory's video. I think that's the best video on it you could watch. Because basically, since I've marked my channel as made for kids, no notifications, can't save my videos to playlist or anything, uh, comments are turned off. It's just so, so dumb. But the will, if you want to leave a comment on a video, well, obviously you can't. But at the beginning of every video, once I, once I can, like, I'll tell you to go to this one video and leave a comment saying it's about that video. Like, say in an episode of Smash Bros. like this one, because apparently the new thing is to record, is to, like, with channel updates, you don't show your face, you talk over gameplay. So that's what I'm doing now. This is Smash's one year anniversary, a video like one person viewed. Nice. But yeah, I will release a video, a certain subscriber special. It will definitely not be COPPA approved. So assuming COPPA doesn't change the law, which by the way, the people who make these laws don't even own cell phones. That's how stupid this is. It's just, please don't put this into action. Just please don't. But yeah, I'll, t I'll remind you at the beginning of every video once that specific subscriber special is released. And then you can leave a comment there about that video. Yeah, okay. So, woo, Kappa sucks. But there was another thing that, that's the opposite of sucking. So, when I first started YouTube, I was like, okay, before one year... I want to get 50 subscribers, and as of like two or three days ago, um, we were at 47, and not gonna lie, I didn't think we could get three subscribers too fast, but then something happened just that night. In a span of 30 minutes, I got two subscribers. We are now at 49. Come on, give me one more, please, before the end of the year. I don't care if the 27th is my actual anniversary for the channel. I mean, really, my anniversary for the channel was like four days ago. But I'm basing it off, like, when my first video released. Which, by the way, I will be doing a special for that. As well as a Christmas special. The day after Christmas. But yeah, I've gone on rambling too long. And I also, when Mario Maker 2 was announced, I decided I want to get 20 subs before Mario Maker 2. We did that. And I thank you. And we, I mean, and because of Mario Maker, we got, like, 30 subs. We got up to 30, I should say. But now, anyways, let's talk about some other stuff. Um, I have way too many ser series on my channel, and I have been trying to end some. That's why I've been uploading so much. I just, I got a two or three more vi episodes of Undertale. Luigi's Mansion, I want to finish that, like, before April. Because, like, I got, th I'm getting three games for Christmas, and I already have too many. So Undertale, we're going to beat that, and then we'll eventually come back to it at some point. I forget what other Untitled Goose game. I've got. I'm trying to finish that. Mario Kart Tour. The last episode will release before the end of the year, which is nice. It's gonna be like this third series. I would have actually. I'm gonna actually end. I mean, there's another. It. It's in the playlist. It says it's a dead series, but I'm actually gonna fix that because in a couple days we're gonna be making another episode of the series. I think I'm gonna like it. But anyway, some new series. Well. Uh, my Christmas stuff, obviously. We got Link's Awakening. I'm going to do that. I heard it's kind of short, which... Yeah, it's my first Legend of Zelda game. I mean, I played, like, 30 minutes of Wind Waker, but that doesn't really count. Not because it's Wind Waker. It's just 30 minutes. And I've been a Zelda fan for, like, as a really long time. And I've been a Pokemon fan even longer, so I'm finally getting a Pokemon game. I'm getting Shield. I am Shield Squad. Yeah. Anyways, so... And I'm also getting Mario and Sonic 2020... Olympics 2020. I don't think I'll actually do a series on that. I'll just do a couple videos, like one, two, maybe three. Nothing too crazy. 
Then, with some series we already have, Smash Bros. and Mario Maker 2. Both those series, they're nice. They're series that will probably never die. A lot like Realmscraft and just go on forever. By the way, I have no idea when running Realmscraft at this point. Like, my friend's now been ungrounded. He helped me do something with a video that will release, like, Monday or Tuesday. I, th I think. I think it'll be Tuesday. I think. Or maybe it'll be... Maybe it'll be Wednesday. I think next Wednesday. So a week from today. No. No, a week from tomorrow. Yeah. So, then is when another Realmscraft... It's not really a Realmscraft episode. You'll find out when we get there. But anyways, speaking of Smash... Oh yeah, I haven't actually said it yet. So Smash and Mario Maker, I've tried to upload consistently, but now I'm just going to upload whenever I want. It's going to be like once a month, or maybe like whenever an update comes or an event's happening or something important, I'll record. If I just feel like doing it, I'll do it. Just, I'll kind of randomly release videos. You'll still get a good couple of Mario Maker videos for the next month or two, because there's some things I want to do. I still haven't made a night level, there's just a ton of stuff. I'll play, I'll do random ninja speed runs when they look good. But yeah, anyways, speaking of Smash Bros, my Smash moveset videos. My last one, I said I didn't like it, but honestly, it wasn't that bad. And, like, n not having anything with the final Smash was okay, because, like, it should be something from the two most popular games. That would just make sense. And I know there was bias towards the games, but I feel like they should all be equally represented. Come on. Like, why does everyone hate... S I think everyone hates Super, because it's a platformer in an RPG series. Everyone hates Color Splash on the Wii U. And I'm pretty sure Sticker Star is just a bad game, but I don't know. But, there were several things I've always wanted to talk about for those videos. Um, different, the stage I want, some spirits, some music tracks, and oddly enough, what the background thingy says on the boxing ring stage. Like Mario is Mr. Video Game. So yeah, I'm gonna have a few hours after every moveset video, I'm gonna have an an extra video talking about spirits and stuff like that. Now, sometime during January, I'll release episodes for all the previous ones. Deltarune and Undertale, I'm not sure if they're gonna be, like, the same one video or two different videos. And for Builder Mario, I'm not gonna do one. And for Paper Mario, I might do one. For Hat Kid, I'm obviously gonna do one. For the movesets, I'm, for every moveset after this, I will do one. Unless it's already a series in Smash Bros, then I won't. But anyways, when I was when I was brainstorming spirits and me costume ideas and stuff like that, there were four spirits that didn't fit into the categories: Mario Maker, Undertale, Deltarune, A Hat in Time, and uh, Paper Mario. That's all I did, right? I don't think I did anymore. Yeah, that's all my move sets. There were four, f no five particular spirits I had in mind. That didn't fit into any of those categories. I know this, these might not be spirits my fans are familiar with. I play Mario and Minecraft. Uh, I will never play a T-rated game on this channel except Deltarune and A Hat in Time. And at one point, I will be doing one. Oh, by, by the way, I, for, I remember, just remembered when I mentioned Skype Specials earlier. We're going to be doing one in between 50 and 100, and then one at 100. That's all I'm going to do. I consider doing one in 82 as a reference to when Mayro did one at 82,000, but whatever. So yeah, you might be wondering, what are those spirits? I don't care if none of you know them. I'm going to show them to you. They are... Oh god, let's go. For those of you wondering, you have the complete and total right... To question my sanity. I have, why isn't the music playing? What, where did the music go? Okay, music's back. Music's good. I mean, the music was never playing. Now this is here. This is quality, am I right? You have a complete and total right to question my sanity, for I have made five spirits based on the game Doki Doki Literature Club, dating sim turn horror game. It's the exact combination of things I shouldn't like. I mean, I like horror games, but it's a bloody horror game. I don't do any kind of violence. <sighs> But here we are. Okay, let's just get this over with. Start out with Monica. She insta kills at 120% plus, or when the opponent's at like 4 fifths HP, 7 eighths, something like that. She's a primary spirit, a grab type, 4 star legend. I mean, 4 star means legend, but whatever. She has two slots. Uh, in her battle, she is the fourth Lucina alt, 
On the Magicant stage, you are flowery and the enemy is attack up at high damage. Yep, pretty... It's gonna be a pretty tough boss. I mean, uh, spirit. <laughs> a pretty tough spirit for a pretty good spirit because... <laughs> oh god. It doesn't matter how good you are at teching or whatever. You will die. <laughs> it doesn't matter how heavy you are. You will die. Anyways, next we have my personal favorite, Yuri, who is... I consider making her, like, bladed weapon attack up because there's only one character with a knife and that character's a DLC character. Because, like, not being a DLC character, if, if like, there's Lucario's aura up, that'd be fine. But Joker is a DLC character, and not everyone owns a DLC. But, I mean, almost everyone does. Imagine owning Smash, but not the, the DLC. It, they might as well make it just cost $85 at this point. C come on! Everyone owns it. I don't know a single person who doesn't own the uh, Fighter's Pass, but does and Smash. A single person. I don't know anyone who owns Smash, but not the Fighter's Pass. Anyways, Yuri is knife attack up. She's a secondary spirit. She, she takes up one slot and is three star. She's in her battle. She's the six corn alt on the Fountains of Dream stage. There's um, an item sword. Swords will spawn a lot. Enemy starts with a killing edge. The enemy's sword attacks are more powerful, and enemy defense up at high damage. So that's Yuri. Next we have Sayori. Oh God. You thought knife attack up was bad. That's nothing. This is tether grab up. Anybody who knows the game knows what I'm talking about. If you don't know the game, I don't need to tell you. I really don't. Uh, she's a secondary spirit who takes up one slot. She's two star. Uh, in her battle, she is Daisy on the super happy tree stage. Oh, she has a minion, which is the third zero suit Samus ult. Minion prefers grab and side aerials. I'm not sure if it's forward aerial, back aerial, or both. So, yeah, something like that. Uh, the one that's the tether grab, of course. The main And the main enemy def uh, prefers to avoid conflict, defeat the main enemy to win. And by the way, if you're wondering, I had the zero, third zero suit all as a minion, because, like, she kind of represents Monica in a way. And, like, she's got the tether, and she's not attacking, she's not a Sayori, but she's getting you, but, like, whatever. Natsuki! Um, I had two ideas. She could be stats up after eating or lightweight. Uh, she, she's a secondary. She would be a two or one star, respectively, for stats up and lightweight. She takes up one slot no matter what. In her battle, she is Peach on the Wii Fit Studio stage. Perhaps do you forget that reference? She heals more from eating, and her item, and there's an item, food. Next we have, and finally, last but not least, probably the best, because it's all of them, all of the Dokis, they are team attack up, uh, primary spirit, normal type, four star, takes up, I mean, has two slots, the battle consists of all the previous fighters, minus zero suit, all fighters have abilities from previous battle, uh, the stage is that one Yoshi stage with one platform, which is actually called Yoshi's Island, I just remembered, uh, healing items heal the whole team for double the amount, so yeah, Natsuki kicking in there, and you die, at 100%. Let that sink in for a moment. That is a tough battle. <laughs> you thought Heroes or Armada was hard. Just, you think a group of highly trained warriors is tough. How about a group of four high school girls, huh? From a dating sim. Turned horror game. Look, look, okay. Maybe I don't just like it because it's a cool horror game. Maybe, may, okay, I'm gonna be honest with you. Maybe I'm a bit weird. Bit, maybe just a bit. Actually, hold up a second. Okay, I, so maybe, maybe it's not just because it's a cool horror game. Uh, may, maybe not, maybe not. Warning, next one's gonna be a bit, like, bloody and stuff. Okay, now we're back to cool stuff. Maybe I'm just a, a bit off. Maybe it's not just because it's a cool horror game. Just look at this character. Wait, what did I say? I didn't say anything. You said something. How could you not love this? This is so cute. I'm such a weirdo. I swear, I don't like anime. I'm not a weirdo like that. If you do like anime, well, you're not exactly a weirdo. So yeah, that was the channel update, as well as some ideas for Doki Doki Literature Club Spirits and Smash Bros. We need horror game representation. We don't need to have Freddy Fazbear as a fighter, but that would be kind of cool. Just 
give us at least a few spirits. I don't think there's a single horror game, anything. At least any games have Sans as a me costume, Shantae as a spirit and an online profile picture, and Shovel Knight as a cis trophy. But horror games have nothing. Please give us DLC spirits. Uh, but yeah, for now, this has been Flame Game 7. Make sure to like, subscribe, and remember, kids, eat your green vegetables. Oh my god, this section took up half the video. Did it not stop? Oh, it didn't stop.